After announcing her shocking split from Channing Tatum in 2018, Jenna Dewan moved on with Tony winner Steve Kazee, welcoming a baby boy and announcing their engagement in early 2020. With a love story that's been full of surprises, here are some strange things about Dewan and Kazee. Relationships are all about having new experiences together, and it can definitely be said that Kazee has introduced Dewan to some weird and wonderful things, even when it comes to some of the more mundane experiences of New York City life. In an interview with Access in August 2019, Dewan revealed, My mom called me and was like, Jenna, you've really never rode the subway? And I was like, no. I was convinced that if I was by myself riding the subway, I was going to go the wrong way or get lost. You know, I just wasn't super comfortable. According to the dance star, Kazee changed all that. She added, But Steve was like, no, we're ending that on this trip. You're riding the subway. As a Broadway star, it's safe to say that Kazee is a pro at getting around the Big Apple on public transport. Dewan went on to dish that Kazee helped her totally overcome her fear of getting lost underground, saying, Now I have the whole thing down. I know how to get the card and everything. Even though Dewan and Kazee didn't start dating until the fall of 2018, the couple actually met years earlier, while the Step Up star was still married to Channing Tatum. While promoting her book, Gracefully You, in New York City in October 2019, Dewan opened up about her Broadway star beau. According to Us Weekly, she said, He was in a show called Once on Broadway seven years ago, and I went to see the show, and I was blown away by him and his talent, crying my eyes out. Basically, Dewan was impressed by Kazee's talent as a performer before she even started dating him. Though, to be fair, she wasn't the only one, considering the role won him a Tony Award for Best Lead Actor in a Musical in 2012. Dewan went on to explain, I took my mom and we got to meet him. We told him, oh my god, you are amazing. Following Dewan's headline-making breakup from Tatum, Kazee messaged her and mentioned their chance meeting all those years ago. Dewan recalled, Years later, I'm single and everything's different, and he reached out to me. That was a really cool moment. Not only can he sing, act, dance, and play guitar, Kazee also sounds like quite the smooth operator. According to Us Weekly, Dewan revealed during the promotional event for her book in New York exactly what Kazee wrote to her after her split made headlines in April 2018. He said, I never forgot meeting you. Of their shared history, Dewan added, Like I say all the time, the universe works in very mysterious, wonderful ways. Starting over and starting um, beginning again is always intimidating until then it's happening and I could not be happier. While Tatum and Dewan initially announced their split in April 2018, their divorce took a little longer to play out. According to TMZ, a judge declared the couple legally single in November 2019, but their divorce wasn't finalized until February 2020, when Dewan and Tatum agreed to a custody arrangement for their daughter. Dewan gave birth to her son with fiancé Kazee in early March 2020, meaning that she got pregnant while still technically married to Tatum. In fact, it seems as though Dewan's baby news may have spurred her on to finalize the divorce proceedings with her famous ex. Dewan and Kazee confirmed that they were expecting their first child together to people in September 2019, announcing in a joint statement to the publication, We are beyond overjoyed and couldn't be happier to be expanding our family. Despite the fact that she was still hashing out the details of her divorce with Tatum, it's understandable that Dewan would want to be declared officially single before she welcomed her new child with Kazee. As TMZ reported, As for why they wanted the divorce decree now, we're told they're both in relationships and it just makes things easier. It also clears the path if they want to remarry. Around the time she became officially single, a then-pregnant Dewan announced her engagement to Kazee. Dewan was blown away by Kazee's performance in the musical Once all those years ago, and it seems that the Broadway star is just as big a fan of Dewan's work. According to a source cited by Life & Style in February 2020, he says he found his dream girl in her and he treats her like gold. Evie too. He supports her and is her number one fan. He gets excited for every little thing they do, like decorating the nursery and taking engagement photos. It's really sweet. But Kazee is under no illusions when it comes to his level of obsession over his fiance. While sharing a photo of Dewan on Instagram in December 2019 when she was pregnant with their first child, he wrote, Disclaimer, I'm aware this is basically a Jenna Dewan fan account now. 
I constantly watch with absolute awe as she carves her path through this world, and all the while she does it with a level of grace that we should all aspire to. I want everyone to know about her because she is a gift to this world in so many ways. So thank you for visiting this fan account. She's a very happy person in general, I think. <laughs> Thanks to you. Yeah, well, I can't take any credit. <laughs> Dewan and Kazee's relationship may sound picture perfect in many ways, but there's apparently one thing that can cause tension between the couple, and that's their closet space. While sharing a photo of a very organized walk-in wardrobe on Instagram in February 2020, Dewan joked, I think it's safe to say that life in general came in, saved my life, and transformed my closet. I've never been a very organized person, so this is a dream. And now Steve won't kill me. Clearly, these two have a lot in common, but it would seem that Kazee is a lot tidier than Dewan. The fact that Dewan got some outside assistance to fix her disorganized closet shows just how much she values their relationship. If arguing over closet space is the only real issue these two have, then Kazee and Dewan are probably going to be just fine. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite celebs are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.